What's about Roddy Gaming 19 here, and it's part three of me. Polish name Andrews. This is a and holy Christ, I think it's low on the ground. So to start off, we have a little space destroyer. Here, here, there. Ten points if you can figure out where I got the idea from. Anyway, it features metric ton of missiles on the front and back. And two of my famous laser guns, which will hurt. This is named the uh, yeah STD zero zero one Z. I think don't know. I told you I don't know Polish in the beginning of this class destroyer. SDZ the STD stands for space destroyer. Okay, because there isn't much to say about it, it legit is a meter of alloy for armor. Two engines and a um, one laser system powering the two turrets and the land system uh, there at the front and there uh, at, at no, the front is here. That's the back. So yeah. Also features a torpedo like missiles, one from the front with a heavy armor nose. Good for ramming. Minus the out ammo at the front. It's got roll and pitch thrusters here. Turning thrusters here at the front and these ones on the back are inverted. So it gives it oh wait no that's not that so it gives it swings the back around and the front forward and it also has spin block clipping which is I'm not a big fan of but given the fact that I use these in a campaign trust me when I say the speed is you're gonna need it okay so Who's the Who's the biggest and baddest friggin' tanks in the game? Let's give him a Goliath. Man, holy Christ, the lag is real. Oh yeah, I think I did this. Nope. No, no, no shields. Yeah, the way you have to miss our system is do it job to some extent. I think I'll have the AI. Oh fuck, I did. I lost me AI on a phone call. That's an old thing. Damn it, that thing has a lot of missiles. So yeah, it wrecked that thing. At 95%, no, wait, what? Two damage at 95%. Help. So yeah, being a destroyer designed to be weak. It can do a lot better in the campaign and take a look on the lightning hoods, which are basically freaking laser freaks. Usually the laser system survives. So yeah, that's the destroyer. One down. Two. Oi, that um, destroyer translates to live. It's the uh, across the three destroyers live with one. Hit named after us. I think I'm broken it up, okay. So here's me a lot. No, here's me. Here's me cruiser. The Urukazi. This is named from that other ship in my beginning. This thing features four to six different same turrets, just different design. More thrusters. With spinball clipping and um, 
two laser systems, one in the back, one in the front, one in the front controls the two t cannon turrets, and the two lines on both sides, and the one at the back is the same before the back. Features more missiles, same amount of missiles as the destroyer, but the three blocks longer. The destroyer had three meter missiles. The front looks a little bit harder. Only features four very long torpedo style missiles. Yes, these are missiles. Torpedoes don't work in air. And I'm, I'm at the front. And I'm at the back. So if this thing got hit, it was going to detonate. And it's legit a meter metal. But that's not great. Also features an under deck um, tri tri cannon. And if we give it a Goliath and turn that breaking thing off, walk around and watch the show, that thing will die. Damn it, what the hell? Yeah, this one comes with shot. Ow, I got shot. So, yeah, this thing was designed to take on the drive flyers. And it does that pretty damn well. Also, the other thing is out well. Ow, I'm going deaf. This is the um, ship name. This is the cr cruiser name from that ship. I can't remember what it translates to. So yeah, that's that. And while we're here, because I absolutely love it. It's English, thank God. Go 5,000 years higher. Wait, 5,000 years? Wait, 5,000 years? But the lag set up the bar. Fuck off this house. Hey, danger close. Okay, this is the um, ABB001 Untraveled Road. Name, given its name due to um, airships. Yeah. A battleship. I've never built an airship in my life. Had to get help for this. Which turned out reasonably. Features 18 cannons in total. Okay, you did six turrets now. Top about three in the top, three in the bottom. Downward firing missiles. And um, upward firing missiles. A lot of them. Oh, and there was a laser turret. And it also has some anti-missile missile interceptors there. And some anti-air missiles here. Uses that super structure from the cruiser, I can't remember its name. Typical me. Alright, warning. Highly explosive cannons. 
and um, again, 10 points if you can guess the reference. It's pr it was pretty famous in the 80s, was it? Well, not so much famous, but people who watched the remake, or I think watched the original. But anyway. This thing can wreck pretty much anything if it doesn't have a powerful anti-missile system and tennis shell system, and if it doesn't have shielding that could take on the flipping Americans. Okay, now where's this count of a variant? There we go, SBV001 on travel road. Both ships cost you under about, about 40,000. The space variant costs 200k more due to lasers. Okay, so. Give it a year to stop breaking on me. The friend, friendly missile from India. Okay, I do apologize for that. Okay. So, it may look the same. However, it features a little thingy here, which it did for coolness. And the turrets aren't exactly cannons. No. They make it look like that due to spin blocks. Lasers. Holy shit, I just fired the missiles. Okay. Okay, exactly the same ship as the ABB. However, this one is more like what I was going for the reference. Space Battleship Yamato. Although not really space because yet yeah, doesn't much space. Now these connect to the laser anti missile system here, which uses spin blocks because of the tension here as well. Now, if a single cannon was to hit there, I'd lose some of my some of my anti missile system. But well, it's fine. God almighty, this thing has a metal ton of missiles. Okay, welcome to second bridge. Okay, that's side view. Other side view. Rear view. Where you can watch the glorious missiles and I'm gonna crash. My pronunciation of Polish words. Not the best at it. So, yeah. If you want to see more, subscribe. But until then, I'll see you next time. Goodbye.